Hey, we're gonna go upstairs into this Simmons Bank building and we're gonna meet Chad Rawls. Hi, is Chaz here? Uh, but he's a business guy. Like us! Tyler, we can't go wearing this. They don't like Japanese cartoons? We need to change our shirts right now. Let's go. Oh gosh, it's so much back. better. It's a zip on tie from Walmart. YKK on my zip. YKK on your zip. This is perfect. We are super good at this. Almost there. Oh, my oh God. look at this tie. I'm not a businessman, I'm a businessman. I'm a businessman. <laughs> Let's have our business meeting. Right here, here we go. Two hours later. Oh, me? Looks like you guys made it. Looks like we made it. What are you doing? We're going to 13. Um, Chad, have you ever stood up here and brought your son Collier here and said, son, everything the light touches Absolutely. will be yours one day? Am I in the middle? Sure, oh, yeah, you're no, in the middle. Chad, no, Chad in the middle. Chad in the middle. So we're talking about your spirit is the part of you that continues. It's the part of you that is going to last forever. A lot of us think that who we are is the things that we've done. Maybe mistakes that we've made. Oh, I, I think the first mistake I've made is inviting NLC Live yeah, in my office. Yeah, that's Never forget, that's I'm a businessman, not a businessman. <laughs> our spirit is where our worth comes from because that is the part that is connected with Christ. That's the part that, at the moment of salvation, was set right, and your mistakes don't define you. I don't like to be defined by my mistakes. You know why? Because I have a terrible memory, so I just forget everything I've ever done wrong. I forgot my flash drive. My wife's like, hey, you remember when you messed up? I'm like, nope. nope. Never <laughs> messed up. Batting a thousand, your boys undefeated. I got run over by election. Oh, Fingers to you your guys like, are. So Chad, you got a, you Pastor Chad, you have a, yes. a scripture that you want to read for us. I do. Uh, Colossians 2, 13 to 14. When you were stuck in your old sin, dead life, you were incapable of responding to God. God brought you alive right along with Christ. Think of it. All sins forgiven, the slate wiped clean, that old arrest warrant canceled and nailed to Christ's cross. Did you write that? I did not. <laughs> Chad, yes. can I ask you a, well, not a personal question, but a question well, to a person? Free. How do you feel like we adapt our lives to hear God's voice? I think there's uh, some discipline that goes into that, being in tune with, with God's voice. Obviously, uh, in order to for me to for me to hear you, I, I need to be close to you. Uh, I can hear you better when I'm close to you. Come on closer. So in order for me to be close to God, it's uh, it's getting in the Bible. Yeah. Reading God's Word. You know, hey, I start my day listening to worship music. I feel like that sets the tone. The way that we walk around, we're trying to figure out a Wi-Fi signal. You're trying to get signal wherever you're, you know, you actually look differently when you're doing it because you're, you're wandering around with your phone up in the air. But if we will do things a little bit different to make sure that we are staying connected with God, with the Holy Spirit, just like what Chad said, worship in the morning, get in some scripture, you're gonna be able to hear his voice and you're gonna rise above that chaos and you're gonna get a stronger signal. A lot of times when we get down in the trenches too much and we're down in the day in and day out and we haven't connected with God, that's when it seems like he's far away and he's not. I need God every day. If I'm not moving toward him, then I'm in bad shape. It's almost like you're either, you're either getting closer or you're getting further away. You can't just stay still, you can't stay stagnant. Like, if you're not moving forward, you're moving backwards. Heavenly Father, uh, please help us respond to you and hear you clearly. We don't want our old way of life to hold us back anymore. We ask that you give us a clean heart, God, as we look to you for direction in our lives. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. You are blessed to be a blessing. Yes. Oh, gosh. I'm not very good at holding this. Amen. Thing. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. wow. He's wow. still going. Deep, this is deep prayer. I didn't know he went and added the footnotes. <laughs> I didn't either. Hey, um, yeah, here it is. I don't even know what that is. Dragon Ball Z, Japanese cartoon. You know Dragon Ball Z, right? Bro, that's Piccolo, Goku, Gohan, Vegeta. He was the best, because he was a bad guy turned good. Love those, you know what I mean? Yeah, Everybody yeah. loves the redemption story. Am I right, Jesus? It's over 9,000! Oh, he's gonna take a nap. Or... Why aren't there more people playing on that escalator? Tyler, are you okay?